Hello and welcome to the MBS show. Let's play. I am your host Norman Sanzo and we are continuing on with our journey into Maritime Bay as we play ta -ta -ta, My Little Pony a Maritime Bay Adventure. Let me turn up the audio for the game. So uh, previously I finished the first level and talk about how the game feels and whatnot and yeah it's pretty cool it's pretty cool so um just to test if the game audio is working or not uh, oh oh now now you want to screw me over eh let's see oh no i've i just remembered i need to click on the game hmm all right mini game setting exit setting mini game play that is annoying <laughs> <clears throat> But uh, a, a comment that I, I forgot, sorry, I forgot your name, uh, mentioned that it kind of helps with the visually impaired. Uh, and and by, when I first thought, hey, uh, a blind person playing the game? No, not really. Um, visually impaired could mean people who have hard of seeing, like me. I, I, I wear glasses to improve my sight. So uh, if somebody were to play this on a big screen TV, 10 feet away, they might not see the screen well, it, it's blurry. So things like Mini game, play. this kind of helps. Yeah, uh, that, that is a cool setting. <sighs> so, um, <coughs> didn't really experiment with the game uh, because there are some other games that came out. Uh, Hi-Fi Rush is one of those games that I've been playing and man, that is very hard um i'm not musically adept i i don't really know beats and times so i i have a hard time with that but anywho uh we're playing pony so let's go yay i forgot what we were supposed to do again anyway um let's see uh let's just collect the stuff oh god easy is that a, is that an arrow? I, I guess I, mm, you know what, I guess we need to head to that direction, but I'm going to collect stars first. Oh god. Oh god. I, I, I didn't notice this at first, but the jump is floaty. Oh, um, not that, not that. <coughs> oh. Oh man, the jump, the jump is floaty, and that is, I blame Hi-Fi Rush for this because that game has really good jumping mechanics, or the jump feels good. Oh god. Oh god. You know, talk to this person. Okay, the hype lady. Mm, let's jump here, jump here, jump here. Let's go, oh God. All right, yeah. So I remember giving it. Uh, sorry, I remember giving this game its praises when it came out. God damn it! Sorry, uh, when I first played it, and it was okay. It it, it wasn't the creme de la creme where um, this is the best game ever kind of deal. But for a licensed pony game, it did the job. It, it just did the job. And I feel, sorry, I still feel the same way for this game. It's just that I feel like... Wow, Lee Main Street is looking real fancy, isn't it? Yep. Alright, bye-bye. Uh, <clears throat> but I still feel like this game could have been done better, but... What what do I want? What do I want in a pony game? Uh, hey! Where do you think you're going? To the Pip Pip Parade! Huh? Wrong answer. Sunny Star Scout, right? You're automatically signed up for the Wings Flight Academy. What? You're listed <clears throat> as a rookie winged pony and have to begin your training ASAP. But I barely know how to fly. Well, that's the point, isn't it? I guess that makes sense. First. You have to test your skills on the ground with an obstacle. Grab all the crystals in time if you want to earn your wings. 
What? Are you ready to train your skills? No. I'm not ready. Boring. We all have to do it sooner or later. Yeah, I just remember. I, I, I had... I had this... Okay, this one. Okay, what's this? Yeah, decorate! Yay! Oh! The decorate subplot has not been done yet? Oh, man. Okay, the, oh, wait, what? How did I miss this? That's not right. I shouldn't have missed this. Alright, let's go. What was I talking about again? Yeah, what, what kind of game would I want? Uh, Hasbro to make for... I guess I can't go through here yet. I don't think they're gonna let me through. So, like I was saying, um, what kind of game would I want them to make? Uh, okay, let's... Let's um, consider what... Hasbro... Oh, hey. Where do you think you're going? oh wow! Alright, I can skip this. Are you ready to yes. Alright! <laughs> I mean, yes sir! Mm-hmm! Let's uh, go! Okay. Ooh. Ooh. Oh. <coughs> well done, good at starting out. He got some moves after all. You've earned them. Yay, I have got access. So what I gotta say, what kind of game would I like to have Hasbro make? God, the cutscenes. Hef, what's wrong? What's wrong? Everything is wrong! My beautiful billboard has been destroyed! No pony will come to my show like this! Outrageous! Maritime Bay is not safe! Who would do something like this? Some pony is out there trying to ruin the event. We must find him. Or her. Or her? No or pony her. can be left unsuspected. Hmm. Some pony had to see it happen. I need you to ask every last pony in this area. I'll ask around. Okay, Wait. um... There's a few episodes I haven't watched yet. Why is Sprout not in jail or anything like that? <laughs> oh, did this thing just went down? I think it did. Huh? No, um, I was saying, why, why is Sprout free and kind of hanging around with the main crew? Uh, give me a second. Oh, this, this is very embarrassing. Oh, no. And I bet you guys are watching at home and laughing at the microphone going down. Oh, God. Oh, I'm sorry, I'm sorry. This is getting... this is annoying. <coughs> Anywho. Yeah, um, there's been a huge gap since um, watching the movie and the Netflix series. Why is Sprout not in jail? Why, why is Sprout hanging with them? What is Sprout? <coughs> so, yeah, um, what? I'm so confused. Anyway, uh, let's continue on. So we need to we need talk to people. Clues. Keep asking. All right. We have one of, uh, sorry, zero of three clues. So this person, this person looks sus. The saboteur has a long blue mane. Long blue mane? Huh. huh. Do we know anybody with long blue mane? I got no idea. Okay, what about you? Bridalwood silks and fashion! No, thank you. Bridal, oh cool. Unicorn? No, how oh, odd. Yay! Phew. Oh! What is this? This is suspicious. We need to crack it. Ah, there's no attack button. Consider yourself safe box. 
Whoever did this has purple fur. Blue mean purple fur. Smoothies. Fruity and yummy smoothies. You person. No. Don't think you know. Oh wow. Oh wow. Oh wow. That's that was Oh god. Alright, um what I was reacting to is this. Oh man, that that is Oh but how how would you solve that? Hmm. Okay, um what I was freaking out is because the texture on the wall or the building was transparent and we the camera moved around inside so we got to see the inner workings of the building but technically bridal wood silks and fashion uh, but technically um it's a minor thing but if they really screwed up things could have been bad Oof. the suspect <coughs> is a unicorn hmm. got all the clues gotta go talk to sprout blue don't mean purple and a unicorn Wait, what? Isn't that easy? Great <coughs> detective work. A unicorn with purple fur and a long blue mane, huh? I think it's clear who did this, Sonny. No, Izzy would never do anything like that. As a sheriff deputy, I'm afraid I'll have to arrest her. No, wait. I'll talk to her. At least bring in her for questioning. You, you you don't arrest if you oh, don't have enough. That. I have to find her. You don't automatically arrest if you don't have enough evidence. You just need to. Uh, is that purple? It looks pink. Whatever. Let's talk. <laughs> hey, Sunny. Is a mere tiny baby just the greatest? <laughs> well, somebody messed with Pip's billboard. It's terrible. I have an idea. We can use it. Yes, that will prove you didn't do it. I didn't do what? Nothing. <laughs> what do we need? We need paint. Lots of pink paint. Can you find some? Paint? Got it. Um, in all honesty, for this one, uh, Sunny should have just told Izzy the situation. And um can't leave now. Oh. I got things to do. Yep, yep, yep. Sorry. Uh Sunny should have just told Easy the to download and Easy could how do I put this? Easy could prove herself of her innocence and they could solve the problem together and whatnot. But eh I I don't think that's gonna work this way because if we if you use logic Oh, paint, cool. Oh, hello. <coughs> Were you looking for some paint? Yes. yes. I need lots of paint. Wonderful. And what do you have to trade? Trade? It's maritime bay day. Money is not allowed. Only trade. It's bad for business, but it does lift the spirit. And what would you want for the paint? Well, I wanted to be a Pegasus guard when I grew up. Having a shop is great, but... If I could only try on one of those cool guard helmets, maybe you could find one for me. Pegasus guard helmet it is. I'll find one. What? Uh, what? Maritime Bay Day, you have... Money's not... What? I, I am so... Oh, what? My, my brain is not... I... I do we now I got to do. <clears throat> yes, yes, yes. Let's go, Sunny. <laughs> oh, I don't have a double jump. That is very disappointing. What? My helmet? No way. Find some pony else. Oh, you big meanie you. Is there any pony here who is on break that I can borrow the helmet? Oh cool, we we can just buy one. Fabulous costume can I get for ya? I'm looking for a guard helmet. A guard helmet? Such a good choice, yes. I do have one, but... But you wanna trade. 
It's the Maritime Bay Day. And all MBD. I'm asking for is a fabulous red flower. Fabulous red flower? Shield! I'll get you one. This is the most dumbest concept ever. Tra trade? You need a red flower? I'll trade you anything. Ah, I wish I could, but I traded my red flowers away. But I do have red flower seeds planted in these pots. Well, I could use magic to grow them. If you're okay with it. More than okay. Please try it on these. Uh, pots and seeds. Grow oh, beautiful oh. flowers of all colors. Alright. I, I got your damn flower. Give me the flower. helmet. Here, a brand new helmet. Okay, thank you. Now you got to no, you need to get the paint. You need to get the paint. You need to get the paint. Okay, here, boy. Look at that helmet. Oh, let me try it on. Looks good. Doesn't it? For Equestria. Oh, that's sad. Yeah, for Equestria. <coughs> a trade is a trade. Here's the pink paint. Perfect. We can fix the billboard now. But it doesn't solve who did it. <clears throat> That'll do it. Catch the billboard. It's unicycling time. Da 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 da. Oh, thank you so much, Sunny. Anything for Maritime Bay Day. I'll wait at the main melody. The crowd will flood in. <sighs> Come, every pony. The show is about to start. Oh god. Have you found Izzy yet? Izzy hasn't done anything wrong. We'll see about that. Something smells fishy here. That is true. It could be or could be not Izzy. We have not we have not looked deep into this case, which I'm guessing we won't because reasons. Yes, reasons. Oh boy. Anyway, let, let's go on, let's go on. Okay, they asked me to go there. No, I don't want to go there. I want to do other stuff. Ta-da! I... Oh no, I, I, I for a moment that I thought there was Lyra. Almost, but not. Nope, not gonna talk to you. Okay, now I will talk to you. You can't go to town park until you get the Maritime Bay Day medal. In the meantime, Pip needs help with her show. Okay. Riddles. Oh. Uh, give me a second before I do the case. <laughs> Unicorns are tough to shop hats for. They pierce through the ball. Hmm, okay. Um, what was I saying? Okay. The questing is very railroady. Which is not bad for a kid's game because you, you have to kind of uh, guide them to point A to point B so that they don't, uh, what you call this, so that they don't um, struggle off and don't do nothing. So this this kind of gives a structure. For adults who play video games a lot, we want to explore and so on. Uh, it kind of hurts it in that department. But hey, uh, it's all good. Uh, let's start this case. <clears throat> Did you find out who ruined my billboards? Actually, no. Oh well, it looks beautiful now. That's what matters. No. Sorry, the crowd is here, but something is missing. Ripples! My backup dancer! There can be no dance show with no dancer. Will you find her? Sure. Where should I look? I'm not sure. She oh likes boy. hiding. And smoothies. I'll find her. The show must go on. Oh boy. Oh, I remember. Okay, so it's that person there. Oh. I, 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 I. <coughs> Is that you, 
Primrose. Oh, no. Primrose is gone. Who? Yeah. It's you, Primrose. Yes, it's me. But I can't go to the show. Why? But why? Is something wrong? It's just that I have nothing pretty to wear. Just that? I'll find some clothes for you. Would you do that for me? I what? need three pieces. Three? Consider it done. Wait, what? Uh, um, uh, do we, what? You'll get so many compliments with this. Sorry, we what? Close for the pony walk? Come and <coughs> My confusion is high. Wait, why is she worried that she has nothing good to wear? This is a show done by insert pony name here uh isn't insert pony name here going to <sighs> supply the clothes for the dance and stuff <coughs> she should be the one gathering stuff for her dancers why why is, uh, it, there won't be a game if oh god There's a store here. Oh, there's a store here. For Pip's show, a very I got them all. It's time to bring them back to Primrose. <laughs> ho ho ho! Hey, let's go. We've got three clothes oh, for you. You got them? Yes. Now you can perform at the show. <coughs> I can't. No, ah, I can't. I can't. What? Why not? Because. What if he doesn't like me? He? Who? Who? Who's he? His? <laughs> Who else? Oh, he's so kind Aww. to every pony. <laughs> so thoughtful, so... You have a crush on him. That's cute. Uh-huh. I see. But Hitch is not in fashion like that. He's not? Are... Are you sure? Nah. He's more into herding bunnies and stuff like that. I thought I would impress him looking my best on the pony walk. But I'm too shy. <laughs> Why? You shouldn't be. You're perfect just the way you are. Am I? Yes. All you need to be is you. You could just walk up to him and say, Hi. I don't know. I'd... I'd feel much better if I had an excuse to talk to him. What if you casually had a smoothie to spare? I oh guess god. That'd be a good excuse. He loves pumpkin spice smoothies. Could you get me one of those? Yes. I'll be your smoothie operator. But my smoothie cart is in the shop. Where can I find a smoothie now? Look right. <laughs> there you go. Is that not a smoothie? Hey there. My smoothie cart's cooler broke. Can you spot me? I'll get you back. Oh, sure. Sonny, you got it. What do you need? Great. Two pumpkin spice smoothies, please. Oh, no. Can't make those. I ran out of pumpkin cream. If you bring some pumpkins, I'll make them for you. Why do you... Why... why, why uh, oh, this one. Huh. Great. Two more but, to go. Oh. Oh, my brain, sorry. It's just that, why why pumpkin spice? I mean, it's... It, it, if it's even a meme, I, I get it, but... Oh, God. If there's no... Uh, I'm just remembering, is it here or not? Oh no, Butterfly says no. Oh. Huh. I don't know how to feel about this. Like, the Butterfly is helping me. 
get to the okay there we go uh helping me get to the uh quest item but I sometimes i now to the shop. <clears throat> okay um what i was trying to say is the butterfly is helping me with the quest item because if i got no idea where it is i could have been looking for it all over the place and uh, in due time i would find it but having the hint system like that does help well alleviate time and get straight to the point so how how do i feel about that um 50 50 really because i do like it in terms of i don't have to waste time and just get straight to the point but at the same time too you kind of take away um the need for exploration um trying things out and trying to find uh, the answer yourself so it's it's a balance of 50 50 where you kind of lead the player to where you need to go and don't waste their time which is good but at the same time too you deny them of exploration and problem solving which is bad but at the same time too you you, you don't really it's one of those things where this is a kid's game where you have to design it in a specific way where it holds the kids' attention and you <clears throat> and they have a good time because uh, in in all reality uh, this game could have been done in about one sitting, probably two, three, four hours at best. Let's just say four hours at best if the kid plays. <clears throat> It from start to finish and on stop Dep also depending where they play it on because uh, the game came out on all major consoles so let's say the lowest common denominator is game on switch so they'll be playing it all over the place um, on the couch on the bed or wherever it is because switch is portable and whatnot um, personally for me I have to do the setup where I have to have a PC and because since I'm talking to you, um, I need a microphone and so what, whatever. So the game I feel is not that long. I think I could be wrong, but uh, depending on who it's aimed at, the game should shouldn't be too long. Like you can take a look, see at the magic bits um, total game. Uh, those are the stars that I was collecting for to, um, for. Total game, uh, it's about almost 2,000 um, stars. And, <coughs> and I'm at uh, 736. So that tells me that you're not really halfway, but you're kind of 20-30% true. So you still have a lot more to go. <coughs> so anyway, um, is that math right? I feel like I'm wrong. Still, um, you, you still have a lot of to go, but not that much. Let's continue on playing. <coughs> Sorry. Uh, if, if, if you remember the timeline for the Norman Saga, I was not feeling too well. I was sick. I was coughing. Um, doing the Transformers thing on a uh, few weeks ago. I'm still coughing. Doing another podcast. I do remember. Was it coughing too much? Kind of getting better. I, I'm having a thing. I, I'm I'm thinking that the more I talk, the more stress I put on my voice. So the more water I need to drink. Sorry. So anyway, let's continue on with the adventure. Woo I saw this movie truck parked nearby. Bleh. One pumpkin spice smoothie coming right up. Thank you. One? I thought it was two. Thank you so much. It's just smoothies. Easy peasy. No. Thank you for encouraging me to be myself. It's always the best thing you can be. And remember, he loves bunnies. Bunnies? Yes. Can you take these clothes to Pip? She'll find a better use for them than me. 
Sure thing. Oh, come on. She knows her fashion. What? I'm just... Okay, let's go. Let's go. Oh, God. to spend my thing doesn't that mean press this button when you're ready to glow up uh bleh, uh oh no this uh, um no. I guess we can take away the bag because we're gonna do dancing. I guess we're good. Three, Wait, two, what kind of game are we playing one, again? Go! Oh, we're playing DDR. Do, do I have to use the analog stick? Can I you not use the D-pad? Please let me say I can use the D-pad. Okay, I'm just gonna try. If I fail, I fail. Oh, I can! Oh no! I am a... What am I again? What's my... Oh, my score. Oh, I, 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 I aced it. Cool. I get 75 more stars and... Pip is unlockable. Yay! <coughs> I 
I I don't know what to say. <laughs> um, clearly, the like I mentioned before, rhythm games are not my forte. And you're probably wondering why was it? Those moves, Sunny. I didn't know you had it in you. Neither did I. You were a good dance instructor. As token of appreciation, here you go. The maritime bay day fun. <coughs> now you're ready to go to town park and herd those bunnies. Maritime Bay Day keeps growing on me. Yay. Look for magic mirrors. Use them with this button to dress up for any occasion. Cool, cool. So, I I'm guessing that's the, what should we call this? Uh, that's the session for <laughs> this week. I'm not oh, cool. I, I, I got those glasses. Okay. Oh, scarf. Earrings. All right, let's let's just see this. I could dress up like Phoenix Wright. Put this on. And put this on. Take away this. But um, I'm Phoenix. <laughs> You're probably wondering. Wait, Phoenix doesn't wear that. He wears a lawyer suit with the thing and whatnot. Um, there is a um, uh, early ish. I, I don't remember, but later on he wears a blue. Uh, what you call this? A blue beanie with a pink scarf. Also with a was it a blue scarf? I don't remember. But I I like this. This 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 is hot. <laughs> no, I'm gonna take this off then. Oh god. Yeah, let's put it <laughs> on the back. Oh god, I'm dying. So, anywho, um, oh, cool, um, I got achievements, yay, uh, so anyway, um, I'm gonna end it here for now, and, so, um, I, I just remembered my, Play. Uh, I just remember my thought, um, what I was trying to say just now, and that was, what would I want a pony game to be? Uh, in all honesty, um, G4, G5, that, that is an argument. Um, that is, I'm going to say not valid now because uh, the time for G4 has quote-unquote passed and we are in the G5 generation. Uh, G5 gener generation. Ooh. Anyway, uh, we are in G5 now. So let's focus on that. So uh, let's go for easy to pull off, uh, not expensive. Uh, quote unquote in the budget range. So let's go for a side scroller 2D um collectathon. Uh, let's go for something like Mario or even DK uh, DKC Donkey Kong Country uh or even Mega Man. Yeah Mega Man is uh, Mega Man's gameplay is uh simple enough. So you could do something like that where uh, you size maybe Sonic. Sonic is also a side scrolling game, classic Sonic anyway. So uh, do something like that. <clears throat> uh, make it a good game. Make it a surprisingly good game, so people will sing its praises and get more eyes on the game and more eyes on the brand. And people will flock to it, and people will have fun. The most important thing is uh, create a game where. It's fun to play and memorable. And then when I say that out loud, Big Corporate says, No, we want the money. Money. So anyway, um, I guess that's, that's my idea. That probably won't, <laughs> won't, won't succeed or do anything with it. So, <coughs> so anyway, um, I have been Norman Sanzo, and this is My Little Pony in Maritime Bay Part 2. Um, what do I think of it, about it so far? It's okay. We we got a few... <coughs> <coughs> we got a few games. I'm oh, sorry. We got a few uh, experiences out of it. Um, we, we got the dancing mini game. Oh, sorry. Uh, sorry. We got the dancing mini game. We We, we collected a few things, and... Uh, oh, 
Oh, my my friend. <laughs> uh, sorry, uh, my friend is texting me because podcast. He listen my my voice is yeah. Anyway, um, getting back on track, remembering words. Yes. Uh, we collected a few things. We helped a few ponies. We played a dancing rhythm game, and overall, it's a lot of fun. Um. Would I say that this has this game changed my impressions overall for the whole game? I I think it's okay, it's fun. It's doing the job that it's meant to do, which is entertain the youngins. But it's a very specific niche. It's ponies, so not G5 ponies to be uh, at that too. So it's G5 ponies, which I'm guessing there's a lot of there's not a lot of attraction to it. There's not a lot of push. So people who would play this are either um, young uh, kids who are into My Little Pony, um, little girls, unfortunately, uh, or fans like me and I would have to say that for what it is it's fun I'm I'm not ripping my hair out because of the gameplay the story on the other hand is making me question wait what why couldn't you do this couldn't you do that wait why, why do I need to do this why do you need to do that uh, but overall, it, 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 it's just me being nitpicky for entertainment's sakes. But <coughs> it's it's just a lot of fun. It's just a lot of fun. So don't take my critique too seriously. Um, just take it as me trying to entertain you all at home. And uh, it being a really fun game. So anyway, um, I have been Norman Sanzo. And thank you for watching this Let's Play. Um, I'll catch you guys on the next one in the future. See ya!